Hi, boys and girls. Um, it's Friday morning. Um, it's the last day of the week, and Mother's Day is coming up. So, hopefully, you all have some surprises in for your mothers on Mother's Day. And happy Mother's to all of you out there. Um, I know it's been a rough time having to work at home, a lot of you, and having your kids at home. And I just know it's not not the same. So, stay hang in there. Hopefully, this will. Well, over soon, and we'll get back to normal if we can as soon as possible. But um, anyway, thank you, mothers, for all you do. Um, kids, today I know what you guys are reviewing this week. Um, the winding down the school year. Um, I'm going to say a letter. I'm not going to say the letter. You're going. I will, but you're going to guess, and then I'll say it. So I'm going to give you the sound and an example of what starts with that sound. So let's see if you can do it. Are you ready? Here we go. A, A, apple. A, good job. B, 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 ball. B, good job. K, 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 candy. C, F, 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 fish. F, good job. Da, 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 dog. D, good job. La, 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 lamp. G, L. Ma, ma, ma. Mom. Good job. M. A, a, a. Octopus. Orange. O, you got it. Er, er, er. Rot. Right, R. J, 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 Jet. Good job, Jet. K, 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 Kite. Good, K. Good for you. N, N, Nut. N, good. P, 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 Pants. P, you got it. Snake. S, got it. Well, well, wagon. W, good job. Okay. Z, zebra. C, got it. X, 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 X ray. X, good for you. Ya, ya, yo, yo. Y, you got it. Z, you got Z. Z's already. Z, zebra. You got it. Okay, we're going to go ahead and do H. I'm going to say H. You tell me the letter. You tell me the sound. And you tell me the what is what? Something might start with an H. Ha, ha, hot. H. Good. Okay, so we, we're working in our ABC mouse and we were going to go to the farm and look at some animals. And if you did that, you might have looked at some chickens or some horses, some cows. We're going to have a story today about a duck. So this is our back cover, front cover, our spine. And so our story is written and the illustrator and the author is Jane Simmons. So there we go. So our story today is called Come Along, Daisy. So let's see. Daisy must be a kind of animal. Yep, a duck. So what does duck start with? Duck, duck, D. You must stay close, Daisy, said Mama Duck. I'll try, said Daisy. He's a very cute little duck. But Daisy didn't come along. Daisy called Mama. What do you think Daisy's doing? Daisy's just like a little child, so she's probably just very interested in everything. Here she goes. But Daisy was watching the fish. It's pretty cool that Daisy can stick her head under the water and watch the fish, isn't it? That's pretty fun. But Mama's not, is a little worried. Come along, Daisy, shouted Mama. Again? But Daisy was far away. She was chasing dragonflies. 
Does your mama like you to stay close when you go to the store or outside somewhere? Yes, she does. Mamas are always watching over us. Come along, Daisy shouted mama, but Daisy was bouncing on the lily pad. Bouncy, bouncy, bouncy. Bang! Wow, what happened? Plop went a frog. Quack, said Daisy. Ribbit, said the frog. Did Daisy run into a frog? I think she did. Boing, plop, boing, plop, boing, plop, splash! Went that frog. Daisy was having fun watching the frog. Was Daisy supposed to be watching the frog? Quack, said Daisy, but the frog had gone. Mama called Daisy, but Mama Duck had gone. Daisy was all alone. Something big stirred underneath her. Daisy shivered. Daisy should have stayed close to her mama, shouldn't she? Yes, she did. She scrambled up onto the riverbank. Then something screeched in the sky above. Ooh, that could be dangerous. That could be a hawk or something. Wow, poor Daisy. Daisy didn't, what, what did Daisy not do? Did she stay close to her mama? No, she didn't. Now she's in a little trouble. So Daisy hid in the reeds. If only mama were here, she thought. I think her mama's probably taught her well though. That's a good thing that she did listen to her mama. Something was rustling along the riverbank. Daisy could care here. It was getting closer and closer. Ooh, what do you think it is? I saw it. Snail. Did you see a snail? And closer and closer and closer. Oh, Daisy's wishing she had stayed close to her mama. Oh, it was Mama. Daisy, come along, she said. And Daisy did. And even though Daisy played with the butterflies, she stayed very close to Mama Duck. I think Daisy did not want to get lost again. She was very thankful that Mama came looking for her, wasn't she? I think she was. Okay, guys, well, you have a good weekend and you have fun with your mamas and on Mother's Day. Make sure you tell them how much you love them. And I will be back next week. And until then, have a blessed day and let's bless everyone. So, ready? We wish you well. So bye-bye, guys. Until next time. Bye-bye.